Hey guys, welcome back to Naked Audio Tutorials. I'm Yong from SG Audio Hive. Today we have a set of uh, Audio Technica AD500X uh, that came in for a removable cable mod uh, to uh, auxiliary 3.5mm removable cable mod. This is uh, quite an old uh, headphone and uh, we have done a lot of uh, mods, similar mods on the same series, uh, the 700. And I mean, uh, this tutorial will be applicable to most headphones uh, which uh, if they are full size and they do have a lot of space uh, in the in the inter in the internal compartment, but for this particular series of the headphone, they do have a small gasket that they can fit in perfectly a uh, female replacement uh, three point five millimeter jack, uh, and it can be done very very nicely. So uh, do look forward to the tutorial later. Let's go. Okay, so for this uh, headphone mod, we require the 3.5mm female jack the, with a screw on top of, of, on the outside, this is the screw type. Okay, we have already removed the ear pads. Okay, we will need a screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver. There is uh, four screws on the outside, so we have to remove them. So for the wire on the outside, we can cut them off. We leave some extra length so that we can work with the connectors and drivers. We remove the sleeving. Okay, so on the inside, there is another housing that is uh, holding down the driver. We remove the screws on it. There's three screws. Okay, so see. Once we have removed the housing, it will expose the driver itself. Okay. So there will not be any soldering on the driver itself as uh, we have the exposed wires on the outside. So we will remove the wires from the second housing. Okay, take note that the wires are currently in the knot so we have to remove the knot. Is for strain relief purposes. Okay, after we remove the knot, we'll remove all the rubber uh, rubber insulation, we'll trim them down. As you can see here, uh, there are only three wires here. So let's thin them first and prepare them for soldering onto the female jack. Okay, we have the red for the right signal, the green for the left signal, and the brown for the ground signal. Okay, the mesh portion is always on the outside, so we have to install it first. And uh, here, let's try to fit the female driver. Okay, let's remove the shrimp relief also, the rubber shrimp relief. And we'll try to fit the female jack. As you can see, uh, it actually fits uh, perfectly without any need to drill or file. This is the same for all the AD series headphones. And the second piece of housing goes here. There's some excess plastic part that we need to cut off this whole piece at the bottom to in, in order to fit the jack. So we'll be using a piece of cutter to cut out all the excess plastic. And now we can fit in the female jack. So without the housing, the driver is loose, uh, so uh, 
we will be installing the housing just one screw to test uh, all the fitting well, but let's install the female jack first okay, on the left side is the left signal on the right is the right signal bottom long piece is the ground signal Right, this is about how it should go later. Let's manage the wire by twisting them around. So that they are easier to handle. So this is the orientation. So the housing will cover up the female jack. Let's secure the housing with uh, one screw first. And we attempt to fit in the whole headphone together. Okay, so the mesh will go in first. In this way, it will be facing the inside. Let's check the orientation. So the female jack has to go through the bottom first. So it has to come out and uh, be screwed onto the bottom first. Let's secure the whole housing with all the screws. Alright, so we have a fit in the female jack. Now let's screw it in and secure the whole part. Use a pair of tweezers to to manage the wires, tuck them in, and the female jack should fit in from the bottom. Let's tuck in this wire also. All right. What is left is to screw in all the external screws. We also install the ear pads. And that's all for the mod. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like our content, uh, please help us to subscribe to the channel. And uh, you can follow us on Instagram uh, and Facebook. Uh, for more updates and uh, if you have any comments or on things that you want to know more you want to learn more any uh, new videos that you want to see any questions uh, do post them in the comments below and uh, I'll try my best to answer everything so once again thank you all for watching